हेलो एवरी वन आई एम बालाजी राव वेलकम टू बी आर मैथ्स क्लास इन लास्ट क्लास आई डिड सिक्स प्रॉब्लम इन एक्सरसाइज नंबर टेन पॉइंट टू वेक्टर ऑलजिब्रा इन दिस क्लास आई एम गोइंग टू डू अनदर फोर प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन वॉट आर द प्रॉब्लम आई एल डिस्कस इन दिस क्लास दे आर ऑल रिलेटेड टू यूनिट वैक्टर इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट टू नो द डेफिनेशन ऑफ यूनिट वैक्टर इन केस इफ यू नॉट वॉच इड my video on definition of unit vector that video link i'll give in cards here before going to start this video please drop a like for this video without much delay let's begin the class you see this question number 7 what they are asking find the unit vector in the direction of a bar they given vector a bar in this question two things you need to observe first one unit vector and that unit vector is in the direction of this vector a bar while learning the definition of unit vector you learn this point a bar divided by magnitude of a bar is a unit vector in the direction of a bar this i clearly discussed in the definition of unit vector a bar divided by magnitude of a bar what it is it is a unit vector along the direction of a bar similarly if you want to find a unit vector along the direction of b bar what to calculate you need to calculate b bar divided by magnitude of b bar what is this this is the unit vector in the direction of b bar in case if you want to find unit vector in the direction of ab bar what to calculate you need to calculate ab bar divided by magnitude of ab bar what is this ab bar divided by magnitude of ab bar it is a unit vector in the direction of ab bar this is the point we learn while learning the definition of unit vector now to calculate unit vector in the direction of a bar i need these two things here a bar already given magnitude of a bar is needed so first i'll calculate magnitude of a bar they given a bar a bar is given as i cap plus j cap plus 2k cap to calculate magnitude of this vector i need scalar components of this vector what are the scalar components of this vector 1 1 2 so magnitude of this vector is what square root of 1 whole square plus 1 whole square plus 2 whole square that equal to root over 1 plus 1 plus 4 that equal to root 6 i got magnitude of a bar as root 6 now i know the formula for unit vector along the direction of a bar what is the formula to calculate unit vector along the direction of a bar a bar divided by magnitude of a bar same thing i'll write here unit vector in the direction of a bar formula is a bar divided by magnitude of a bar a bar they already given in the question what is a bar a bar is i cap plus j cap plus 2k cap divided by magnitude of a bar i got that magnitude of a bar as root 6 so what i'll write here this i can write it as 1 by root 6 into i cap plus j cap plus 2k cap this vector simply i can write like this what is this this is the unit vector along the direction of a bar i hope you understand this solution now we will move to next question you observe this question number 8 what they are asking find the unit vector in the direction of pq bar we need to find unit vector in the direction of pq bar this problem is similar to earlier problem to calculate this what they given they given the point p and they given point q first thing what is the unit vector in the direction of pq bar the unit vector in the direction of pq bar is pq bar divided by magnitude of pq bar this is the formula to calculate unit vector in the direction of pq bar okay to calculate this i need pq bar i need magnitude of pq bar but if you observe the question they given just the points p and q they not given pq bar they not given modulus of pq bar so first i'll calculate pq bar and its magnitude to write this formula first i'll write given information they given the points p and q what i need to calculate i need to calculate 
PQ bar. What is the formula to calculate PQ bar? In triangle of vector addition, we learned this formula. AB bar, the vector AB bar can be written as OB bar minus OA bar. Similarly, the vector PQ bar can be written as OQ bar minus OP bar. So, what is the formula for PQ bar? The formula for PQ bar is OQ bar minus OP bar. So, to calculate PQ bar, if you know OQ bar, OP bar, it is enough. But in the question, OP bar, OQ bar not given. But we know that every point can be expressed in terms of its position vector. While learning the theory part, you learn this point. If the point P equal to x comma y comma z then op bar can be written as x i cap plus y j cap plus z k cap similarly as they given the point p you can write op bar what is op bar i cap plus 2 into j cap plus 3 into k cap as they given point q you can write oq bar position vector of point q is what 4 into i cap plus 5 into j cap plus 6 into k cap when they given a point p then easily we can write its position vector every point can be expressed in terms of its position vector so now i have op bar oq bar this is the formula to calculate unit vector in the direction of pq bar so i need pq bar what is the formula for pq bar the formula for pq bar is oq bar minus op bar Okay, now subtract these two vectors 4 minus 1 that is 3 into i cap plus 5 minus 2 that is 3 into j cap plus 6 minus 3 that is 3 into k cap. You observe I got the vector pq bar. Now this is the formula. Na? In this formula I need magnitude of pq bar also. So I will calculate magnitude of pq bar. What is magnitude of PQ bar? To calculate magnitude of PQ bar, I need their scalar components. And what is the formula? Root over. What are the scalar components of this vector? 3, 3, 3. So 3 whole square plus 3 whole square plus 3 whole square. Okay. What is this? This is 3 times of 3 whole square. 3 whole square is what? 3 whole square is 9. If I simplify this, this is root 3 into root 9 root 9 value is 3 now so if you simplify this you will get 3 into root 3 i need to calculate unit vector in the direction of pq bar i know that formula is pq bar divided by magnitude of pq bar now i have pq bar and i have magnitude of pq bar also now directly i'll write the formula unit vector in the direction of pq bar what is the formula the formula is pq bar divided by magnitude of pq bar okay what is pq bar you observe here this is pq bar in this pq bar here 3 is there here 3 is there here also 3 is there so i can take 3 common take 3 common this pq bar can be written as 3 into i cap plus j cap plus k cap whole divided by magnitude of pq bar what you got magnitude of pq bar as 3 into root 3 now what happens this 3 3 will get cancel this is over i calculated unit vector in the direction of pq bar if you want to simplify one more small simplification step you can write this whole divide by root 3 can be written as 1 by root 3 into i cap plus j cap plus k cap what is this this is the unit vector in the direction of pq bar i hope you understand solution for this problem now we will move to next question you observe this question number nine what they are asking for the given vectors a bar b bar they given two vectors a bar b bar for these two given vectors what they are asking find the unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar you observe this is also similar to last problem unit vector in what direction in the direction of a bar plus b bar what is the formula to calculate unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar? The formula is a bar plus b bar divided by magnitude of a bar plus b bar. What is this? This is the formula to calculate unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar. To calculate this, first I need a bar plus b bar 
and I need magnitude of a bar plus b bar. As they given the vectors a bar b bar, I can easily calculate a bar plus b bar and its magnitude. So to calculate unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar, first I will calculate a bar plus b bar. I written given vectors a bar and b bar. Now I need to calculate a bar plus b bar. Calculate a bar plus b bar. You just add these two vectors. You observe here 2 plus of minus 1 that is 1. 1 into i cap. 1 into i cap plus minus 1 plus 1. Minus 1 plus 1 is 0. 0 into j cap plus 2 plus of minus 1 that is 1 into k cap. If I simplify this 1 into i cap is nothing but i cap. This is 0 plus 1 into k cap is nothing but k cap. So when I calculate a bar plus b bar I got i cap plus j cap. Now I need magnitude of a bar plus b bar. Magnitude of this vector a bar plus b bar. To calculate magnitude of the vector a bar plus b bar I need scalar components of a bar plus b bar. What are the scalar components of a bar plus b bar? You see here 1 1. So what you will get here 1 square plus 1 square that is root 2. Okay. Now I know what is a bar plus b bar. I know magnitude of a bar plus b bar. Now I can easily write. What is the formula to calculate unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar? This is the formula. I will write the same thing. So unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar is a bar plus b bar divided by magnitude of a bar plus b bar. Magnitude of a bar plus b bar is root 2 and a bar plus b bar is i cap plus j cap. Na? So what this can be written as? This can be written as 1 by root 2 into what is a bar plus b bar that is i cap plus j cap. So this is the unit vector in the direction of a bar plus b bar. I hope you understand this. Now we will move to next question that is also based on unit vector only. You observe this question. Many students they feel difficult to understand this question number 10. Actually it is very easy. First you try to understand what they are asking in the question. Find a vector in the direction of this vector. You observe they are not specifying it is a unit vector. Find a vector which is in this direction and whatever the vector you are finding that vector magnitude is 8 units. You need to find a vector whose direction is along this vector and whose magnitude is 8 units. First I will consider given vector as a bar. First I considered given vector as a bar. This vector magnitude is 8 units. I need to check first. First I will check given vector magnitude is 8 units or not. To calculate magnitude of this vector, I need scalar components of this vector. What are scalar components of this vector? 5, minus 1, 2. So what is its magnitude? Square root of 5 whole square plus minus 1 whole square plus 2 whole square. If I simplify this, what I will get? 25 plus 1 plus 4. This is 25 plus 5 that is 30. So magnitude of given vector is root 30. Its magnitude is not 8 units. Okay. One thing is clear. Given vector magnitude is root 30. What you want to calculate? You need to find a vector. You need to find a vector in the direction of a bar. Here I will explain few things. Please you understand this. Later we will continue the solution. You take in this vector as a bar. Na? What do you know about a bar divided by magnitude of a bar? It is a unit vector. Last three problems we did that only now. A bar divided by magnitude of a bar is a unit vector along the direction of a bar. This is the unit vector. That means its magnitude is 1 and the direction of this vector is along the direction of a bar. Now what I will do, I will multiply this vector with 8. Let's see what happened. 8 into a bar divided by magnitude of a bar is a vector along the direction of a bar. This is the vector along the direction of given vector. I take in this vector as a bar. Now. And what is magnitude of this vector? When I calculate its magnitude, you see, when I calculate its magnitude, you know this formula. Magnitude of m a bar formula is what? m into magnitude of a bar when m is positive. So this can be written as 8 into magnitude of a bar divided by magnitude of a bar. You know that a bar divided by magnitude of a bar is a unit vector. So magnitude of a bar divided by magnitude of a bar is what? Is 1. So you will get 8. So you can observe here. 
this is a vector along the direction of a bar and whose magnitude is 8 units what is the vector in the direction of this vector whose magnitude is 8 units that is 8 into a bar divided by magnitude of a bar this is the vector whose magnitude is 8 units and the direction of this vector is along the direction of a bar so as i taken given vector as a bar now i'll try to calculate this you observe what i written 8 into a bar divided by magnitude of a bar is a vector what is the direction of this vector along the direction of a bar with magnitude 8 units with magnitude 8 units so now i'll calculate this vector 8 into a bar divided by magnitude of a bar 8 into what is a bar a bar is 5 i cap minus j cap plus 2k cap divided by magnitude of a bar what is magnitude of a bar magnitude of a bar is root 30 so this is the vector along the direction of given vector and whose magnitude is 8 units if you want you can do little bit of simplification what is that little bit of simplification this complete vector you multiply with 8 8 into 5 that is 40 i cap minus 8 j cap plus 8 to sir 16 k cap whole divided by root 30 this is the required answer these problems are very easy if you are good in the concept i hope you understand these problems with the help of concept if you like this video please drop a like for this video and share this video with your friends so that they also will get benefit in case if you are not yet subscribed to my channel subscribe now Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.